Hey guys, what's up? It's Daniel with TrailerMountain.com and today I'm testing and reviewing the Gecko XL smartphone mount. This is a flexible uh, smartphone mount that can carry, you know, can hold smartphones, you know, small cameras and whatnot. <laughs> It's really, really cool and I wanted to show one for you. So I'm gonna get it out of the packaging. I'm gonna show you why it's cool and why you should potentially wanna buy one of these. All right, so here it is right here. This is the Gecko Pod. And um, so what this does is on the bottom side here, you have your mount. And that's just a little standard screw mount for any kind of, uh, you know, small point and shoot camera or, you know, larger camera. And it also has a cell phone adapter. So this is the cell phone mount right here screw mount on the bottom and the way, the way this works is these things kind of fold open like that and then has this springy little section right here so what you would do is you would kind of just screw this thing in lay that flat my iphone 6 plus uh, open this up kind of just sit this in here with case holds it in place it's not gonna fall out or anything like that and these arms are completely adjustable so you can lay this thing you know flat use it like a tripod you know kind of thing and this way you have a great way to do it uh, to mount you know your your smartphone and these are completely adjustable I mean you can wrap this stuff around you can hang it if you need to and what's really cool about this particular mount is that it's also I'll get my phone off of it just so I can show you. <clears throat> and we'll get this mount off. This little screw, there's another hole right here. So feasibly you could also hang this thing on like a hook on a wall and then kind of do it like that. Or you can just take this one completely out, put it in here, and then mount your cell phone to the outside here, put your smartphone back in. So you could use this thing as like, an, uh, like a selfie stick kind of thing, or you know, you could also mount this thing to a wall. And you know, there's multiple uses for this thing, which is really cool. I do you like how flexible it is? And there's multiple ways you could really use something like this. Take that off, put it back here in the middle. So another great thing about this is that if you didn't really know where to put it, it's kind of bulky. You can actually just kind of wrap this thing up like this and just wrap it around your tripod, you know, so it's always there. You know, you could also hold it, you know, if you're doing it the other way and you wanted this thing like as a, as a kind of a handheld or almost like a selfie stick, you can. So it's a great little tripod for a couple of reasons. One, because it's super flexible. I mean, you could put this thing in any specific shape or form and, it, you know, you'll get your level shot. Plus, it grips onto just about everything just because it's so flexible and just wraps around. You know me, I'm a big fan of branding, so you have the logo right there. You also have another little stamped logo right there, and then company name, which is really cool. Plus, the fact that you could take the little screw mount off and move it to the outside here. Plus, that it has this hole on the other side here, so you can actually just kind of hang that on a wall, and then you can just use your cell phone mount right here. This thing has a ton of different uses. And you can just tell how flexible this thing is. These arms are tough too, so it's not like, you know, you're, you know, you put a heavier camera on here, it's not gonna sag on you or anything like that, which is really cool. So all in all, the Gecko Pod is pretty cool. So it's designed, so the XL is designed for GoPro style cameras, uh, smartphones, mirrorless, and DSLR cameras as well. This thing will also support cameras up to 2.6 pounds, so pretty decent size uh, camera weight that, that, is, that this thing will hold. So another cool feature is on every single edge here, there's the reason why they call it the gecko pod is because they have these little kind of, it's like a textured kind of a finish on the feet. See that, they have these little kind of little padded sections on the feet. Part of the reason why they call it a gecko pod because it looks like a gecko's foot. Uh, it also has the, kind of the shape of the gecko's head. Anyway, um, pretty cool. I like how they incorporated that into the design. So thanks again for tuning in to my latest video on the Gecko XL. 
I uh, really like this uh, mount. It's real versatile. It's pretty cool. It's not terribly heavy, but um, it offers a lot of versatility. So very similar to a, um, you know, the versatility of like a Joby uh, Gorillapod. So another cool feature is on the actual screw mount itself, you know, you have your little handle that pops up so you can really torque down on there, but it's also a flathead screw. So if you got a nickel in there or a quarter, you can really tighten down and really secure the camera mount. Uh, or the camera, per se, if you're screwing this directly onto the camera. It's also available in green. So if you don't like the black, you want to get a green one, you can get the green too. That's pretty cool. So they also have a few other products as well. They have a smaller version of this for smaller cameras. And I'll leave a link down in my description box below so you can go check these guys out. Also, too, please like, share, and subscribe. Here's the like button right down here. Give this video a thumbs up if you found it informative and subscribe. Here's the subscribe button right here. When you click on that, you're going to stay up to date on the latest gear reviews that I'm working on here on Trail and Mountain's website. So it really means a lot when people subscribe to my channel and like what I have to say about the gear that I'm testing. So thanks very much. If you guys have any questions or comments about this, I'd love to hear what you guys have to say about it. Leave them down in my, in my comment section down below and I will get back to you as quickly as I can. So on a side note, we're also doing a John Muir Trail through hike and we're raising money for charity. We chose Big City Mountaineers as our charity, and what they do is they take inner city youth, kids that are troubled, you know, from broken homes, no mom and dad, you know, they just don't have a positive role model in their life. So what Big City Mountaineers does is they take these kids and they take them completely out of their element and into the backcountry for a week at a time where they um, teach them, you know, team building skills, life changing skills, positivity, give them positive role model and show them what they're capable of and what they can accomplish if they really, you know, work together. So it's a great cause. We're raising money for Big City Mountaineers. We're doing the John Muir Trail, which is 222 miles next year, August, September, uh, depending on when we can get our entry date. And we're doing the whole thing. So Yosemite to Mount Whitney, which is the tallest peak in the lower 48 states. So in the description box down below, I'll have the link that takes you right to the website where you can make your tax deductible donation. Every donation helps, gets us closer to our $10,000 goal. Please head on over to the website and make your donation, help support this great cause. So once again, thank you so much for checking out my latest video. Please keep checking back for more gear reviews, outdoor related hodgepodge, gear talk, and giveaways. Take care guys, get outdoors.